lost, I look in need, there is no comparison You put them bitches in a line and I'll embarrass them But if it's simply written, all this shit that I be kicking Ain't no point to the jungle, really, all these bitches kidding Who they kidding? You do a show when you tuckin' your diamonds, bitch How you was throwing, they shining You don't be rapping, you lying I know the truth, you ain't a hundred, you fool Two, three block, boy, I shoot Four windows, one roof, it's a four door Ain't no coupe, we swing it through Okay, so right here I'm using the Take Me Back to Brazil palette. I'm using the yellow shade, the um, brightest yellow shade in there, and I'm just packing it on. And I didn't make an intro, so I'm just going to do, I just got right into the video, so yeah. So, but I'm just blending it out. I'm using a um, fluffy blending brush from Wet n Wild. I'm just packing it on, blending it out. And I did put concealer on my lid before I started this also. Just to, um, as a primer, I always use concealer. And you really want to blend this out. You want to blend, blend, blend. It's just like, I'm using this yellow as my transition shade. And I'm doing a look that you saw in the video that was before, like, I started putting on the eyeshadow and stuff, doing that look. But in this video, I didn't add, I didn't um, have me putting the blue at the bottom. Because it was just like, a, I thought about that, doing it after I did the video, but I did put blue under it. So I just took a orange shade from the, okay, no, I'm wrong. I'm still taking the yellow shade and I'm just packing it on. Now, this is the Morphe 305M, I believe. I'm taking the shade, and I'm just putting it into my crease to darken it a little bit. I think I did take an orange shade from the Take Me Back to Brazil palette and put that in my crease also. Taking a reddish orange shade, deeper reddish orange shade, just putting it in my crease, blending it out. Taking a brown shade from the same Marshy palette, and just putting that into my crease. Just trying to get my crease a little bit darker, a little bit more dimension in it. Yeah, I took a darker brown because I wanted it a little bit darker. Like when I I was I wanted to go darker, but I was just so scared it's gonna turn out wrong. So I just went a little light headed. I mean light handed, you know, with a um, um brown. But now I'm cutting out my crease, and I'm not the best at cutting out creases. So yeah, this is like my third time doing a cut crease i'm trying to get better that's why i'm trying to do them more and more i'm just blending out the edges it's kind of i did kind of like a um, halo cut crease and it's so hard for me to keep my eyes closed when i have to do this but i try to do my best yes yeah, blending out the edges and then i didn't show the shade that i use but this it's from the morphe 305 palette and i'm just putting i'm just um Putting the um, brown shade or orangish red shade that I used in my crease, I'm um, putting it on the edges, the outer corner and the inner corners. That was the mix I used, and then that um, pinkish shimmery shade between them two is the shade I put on my lid. So now I'm just um, blending my crease a little bit more, getting the shimmer that might have fell inside my crease out of my crease by just blending it out. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.